This is News Channel 5. Today, a community gave a big thanks for helping to end a nightmare. Ashlyn, shaken after mother of two, Lynn Jackenheimer, disappeared, only to be found murdered last summer. And it took more than a month for that nightmare to end. And that was when the U.S. Marshals tracked down her suspected killer in a nationwide manhunt. They finally found Nate Summerfield camped out at a Medina hotel. Investigators say he killed his ex-girlfriend while on vacation with her children in North Carolina. Today, the community thanked the marshals for catching him. News Channel 5's Shea Harris was in Ashland for the ceremony. We're here at the Ashland County Sheriff's Annex where U.S. Marshals just thanked the entire community of Ashland County for helping bring Nathan Summerfield to justice. Today, we are so happy to honor the citizens of Ashland County with our Citizen of the Year Award. U.S. Marshals from the Northern Ohio Violent Fugitive Task Force say it was the efforts of the entire Ashland County community that put Nathan Summerfield, the man accused of killing Lynn Jackenheimer last July, behind bars. You stood by our side last summer in this same room and partnered with us to make sure that Nathan Summerfield was quickly brought to justice. In that investigation, you supported us and came together as no town we have ever seen before. Jackenheimer's mother, Laura Johnson, says the award belongs to each and every person who cared enough to send a tweet, text, or make a phone call. Without him, we wouldn't have um, brought her home or had him arrested. Johnson says she wouldn't wish her family's pain on anyone. She says it's been very hard. We have my daughter gone and my grandchildren without a mother. It's just been the hardest thing we've ever heard. Nathan Summerfield is behind bars awaiting trial. Meanwhile, the mother of Lynn Jackenheimer says she hopes the community and the world will continue to keep her daughter's name alive by fighting against domestic violence. On your side, Shay Harris, News Channel 5.